this on three, two, one. What is going on guys? It's another vegan back with another video. And today we're going to continue the Q Beats journey. If you guys don't already know, the Q Beats journey is pretty much just a playlist of videos where I show you guys how to make samples inspired by Q Beats. That's pretty much it. As you guys seen by the thumbnail already, I'm gonna be using a little music box. It's actually my sister's music box that I took. If I open it up, you can go ahead and hear that. Pretty dope. We're gonna use that to make a fire melody. And I'm also gonna use a flute that I'm gonna sample from YouTube. That's pretty much it. You really don't need much when it comes to these things. If you're creative enough, you'll be fine. That's about it. Let's go straight into FL Studio and let's make some fire samples. All right guys, so now that we're in FL Studio, let me go ahead and just show you the piece of sample that I chopped from the music box right here. And pretty much I just took one little hit and added a bunch of effects to it. So this is what it sounds like. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you the effects that I added. Pretty much we added a Paramesh EQ just to clean that up. We added a Sound Goodizer just to beef up some of that volume. We added a Fab Filter Saturn just to give some distortion and bring out some of them high frequencies. Added another Paramesh EQ, cleaned it up again. I added some RC Retro Color just to give it that old kind of vintage vibe. And then I added some reverb, but I kind of routed the reverb to a bus just because I didn't want the reverb getting in the way. So this is just as big as possible. We got the wet pretty much all the way up and I kind of mixed it in a little bit. So that's the final product right there. Very simple, nothing too crazy. Here's the sample right here. Actually, I just want to show you guys exactly where I got this flute from. I literally just typed in, get the hell out of here. I literally just typed in real flute sample. And this video comes up of this guy playing. It's very low quality, by the way. So I said, hey, that sounds pretty cool. And this is pretty much the chop that I got from that. Right, so we go ahead and added a parametric EQ just to clean it up. So let's go ahead and play that. Right, and then we added a multi-band compressor, and then I used a fab filter Saturn to add some distortion to some of that high end and bring it back out. And that's pretty much it. That's what we're gonna use to make these samples. And let's go straight into the melody. Let's not waste any more time. All right, that's not that bad. All right, so now that we have those chords set up for us, let's go ahead and connect those notes and let's start making like a little melody from this. All right, now that we have those notes, let's go ahead and start back over here. We can. Duplicate that one more time and then we can make some changes on the second half and then let's go ahead and change this chord right here I want to move this up and Then we can move these according to what I just did All right, so now that we have that melody, let's go ahead and press alt R to randomize and then alt S to strum just a little bit Okay, that's not bad. Let's go ahead and add some gross beat just to kind of spice this up a little bit. Uh, let's see what a halftime sounds like. So. So let's go ahead and raise the octave. All right, let's go back to the halftime and let's go to a one half and see what that sounds like. And let's raise the octave. Now 
let's go ahead and turn this smooth all the way up or all the way down. See what that sounds like. All right, I like that right there. Now let's go ahead and add this flute in here and just see what else we can do with this sample right here. So that sounds pretty dope, pretty fast. And like I said, no omnisphere, no contact, just some effects and some sampling and some creativity. All right, so we're gonna have to work with that because obviously, shut up, bro, Jesus. And that is pretty much it. If you guys haven't already subscribed to the channel, go ahead and click that red button down below. If you haven't followed me on social media and other VGN across all platforms, you guys know what to do. If you guys have any video suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. I really wanna know what you guys wanna see. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bam.